Now, President Akufado has commissioned a 70 million euro in Elmina fishing port in Elmina Central Region. The project aims to provide adequate space for a deep marine facility to boost the fishing sector in the region. Speaking at the event, President Okufado highlighted that the project would greatly benefit the fishing industry and serve as a symbol of hope, progress and prosperity for the people of Elmina. Richard Kwejonyanko has more in this report. The president at the commissioning of the 70 million euro project indicated that the port will strengthen Elmina's position on the fishing and salt industries and place the city at the heart of the cultural ambitions, making Elmina one of the most dynamic coastal cities in Ghana. He reiterated government resolve to remain resolute in the pursuit of programs and initiatives that support the growth of the fishing industry. The project created a significant number of jobs during the construction phase and would also create additional job opportunities, both direct and indirect, when operational. This fishing port project represents a significant milestone and as to the existing two fishing ports of Tema and the Sekendi Takrade, government remains resolute and will continue to pursue programs and initiatives that support the growth of the fishing industry. As we commission the project today, I urge all of you to take keen interest in and address collectively the challenge of illegal, unreported and unregulated fishing and other unhealthy fishing practices that have the potential to deplete our fish stock. These illegal practices have resulted in and may continue to lead to a significant loss of potential income for coastal communities. We must work together to safeguard our fish stocks, promote sustainable practices, and address the socio-economic needs of the fishing communities. The president thanked the people of Elmina for keeping faith with government over the construction of the project and not listening to people he refers to as naysayers. I thank the people of Elmina for trusting the Okufuado government to deliver this project, whose sword I cut on 20th August 2020. And I thank you for not listening to the naysayers. I remember that after the sword cutting, the former president, John Dramani Mahama, the perennial NDC presidential candidate, came to Elmina four months later in December and described the fishing harbor as, quote, a Sakawa fishing harbor, unquote. He was emphatic in his statements that the construction of the Amina Harbor would never materialize. It is just as well that he is not God. And I'm equally happy that he, together with all the other naysayers, are alive today to see President Akufu Addo commissioning the Amina Fishing Port. Central Regional Minister Justina Mari Godassan emphasized the need to ensure the fishing industry remains vibrant to serve the coastal communities and the people of Ghana. This project has therefore come at an opportune time to provide adequate facilities such as administration building, workshop, a shed for the fisher markets, coastals, a new slipway for bigger vessels, a boat refurbishment area, a modern place of convenience, a daycare, bathing space, and a deep marine access to ensure the durability of the Elimina Harbor. The Paramount Chief of the Edna Traditional Area, Nana Kujukundia, said the project was, was a dream come true after many doubted it would materialize. The project is expected to increase the accessibility of the port and extend its capacity improve the fishing industry in the central region as a whole, and also boost the touristic appeal of the UNESCO-classified Elmina Castle. Reporting for Joy News, Richard Kwejenyakon, Elmina.